Oh, hi, Steve. It's John here in Barcelona with the results of the Barcelona jury. Uh, <laughs> how's it going, Steve? OK, OK, so it's, it's pushed back. What time's uh, airborne? Oh, OK. OK, so what time do you reckon he's going to be here? Thanks, Steve. Just trying to find out what time he's going to be here. Uh, we had a few problems at uh, Heathrow with check-in, so we're running about an hour late at the moment, but uh, Steve in our ops department in London uh, is just checking on that. OK, well, the flight's... Um... Oh, OK, goodbye. Goodbye. All right. goodbye. OK, thanks, yeah, bye. OK, the uh, flight's airborne from London. It's about uh, an hour and a half to get here. So it should be here about 11, which is two hours late. Uh, we got a couple of hours in which to turn it around. Um, there could be some difficulties later on because of the handling of 747 here. We don't come into the main terminal. We're out on a remote stand. Uh, we've got a large number of wheelchair passengers to get off and a lot of people that need assistance but we should be able to turn it around the main thing is to get it from here on time back to london to operate our flight to sydney this evening on time um, here at barcelona they don't get very many 747s probably once uh, once a month or so um, and they oh sorry no i don't they don't, it's not, it's yeah, not, it's not a regular, reg, yeah. 747s don't come in here on a regular basis. Okay. Um, here in Barcelona, 747s don't come in on a regular basis, so uh, a lot of the staff are not fully familiar with how to handle the aircraft and need guidance, so it can sometimes take quite a while to turn the aircraft around, and especially if you have to get a large number of wheelchairs off, people that require assistance, it can take some time. OK, thanks very much, yeah, bye, bye. Hola, buenos dias, how are you? John from Qantas, hi. Just, just to let you know that our flight's coming in a little bit late, it's coming in about 11, should have been here at 9. OK, um, we need 12 wheelchairs, can you do that? Yes, well, of course. And a high lift as well, because okay. they can't make it down the stairs. You will got it. And I need to know the parking stand as well. Okay. You need the number for the parking. Yeah. Parking number 62. 62. Okay, yeah. that's great. All right then. Okay. That's lovely. Thanks very much indeed. See you You're later. welcome, sir. Okay, thanks. Bye. Okay. So just saying, well, that seems to be okay. Yeah, okay. Okay, so over. We're running. Uh, Okay, everything seems to be all right there. I'll take my, this is my entire office here at Barcelona Airport. What's happening here is that um, last night on the ship when it docked, um, the passengers put their bags outside their rooms. They put their own tags on. They were collected from outside the, the room, the cabins last night, sealed in this truck. They were all checked on by a security list. And what we're doing now is we're taking them off checking them again and loading them in, into the containers so that hopefully when the aircraft arrives they'll be ready to go straight on. Um, that's the theory anyway. We hope it works out. Yeah. Oh, okay. Right, aircraft just coming. It's about two hours late. Should be on stand any second, and then the funnel starts.
welcome. How are you? Good to, good see, to see you. Good to see you. How's things? All right? All right yeah. Had a good trip down? Yes. yes. Good? Excellent. Any problems? No, we won't be able to do that trip, though. No, that's true. We've got 12 wheelchairs. Okay. Oh. Okay, once all the uh, passengers are off, we have to start looking into the departure. So I'll have to have a chat with a load controller who travels on the aircraft to work out what the passenger load is and the baggage weight and the weight of the aircraft for takeoff purposes. Okay, let's get you in the back door. Okay, you're right. Yeah, I'll just sit there. It's going very well actually. I've moved my office location now to the boarding gate. The loading's going okay. In fact, the aircraft's loaded now, so it looks like we'll be able to be on time. We've got to do the boarding yet, which is all done manually here. No computers, so we have to tick off names. That's sometimes a difficult process. We've been told we don't have a slot time, but when everybody's on board, when we call the tower, we'll see what happens. But at the moment, it looks like we'll be on time. Fingers crossed. Just need your boarding cards now. You don't need your passports. Okay. And your Tesco cards as well. If you've got your Tesco cards, we need those. No, we don't need your Tesco cards. Really. But if you've got them, you can show them anyway. Then you can't go. Sorry, you have to stay here. Is that all right? You have to stay here for another month or so.